Hi, my name is Victoria. I grew up in Christchurch in Queensland and currently I'm a second year student studying law and commerce, majoring in economics at the University of Auckland. Living and studying in the city definitely has its benefits. I'm here in the beautiful Albert Park, right across the road from uni. And down the bottom of the hill is the excitement, thrills and shops of Queen Street. Another great way to make new people and get involved in campus is joining clubs and societies. One of the major reasons that University of Auckland is so attractive is its scholarships on offer. I was lucky enough to be awarded one of the University of Auckland scholarships. This pays all my tuition fees for three years. I get a five grand living allowance for three years and two return flights home every year. Every Tuesday I come out to Southern Cross College in Mangere to act as a mentor for the seven form students here. Another common misperception is that Auckland doesn't have the social life to rival that of Otago. Well, not only is first years of the hall all the excitement you could ever wish for, but Auckland does have a pretty out there nightlife. It's not all about partying or the social scene. Auckland has a number of really cool little posies to check out, such as Ponsonby, taking a coffee or a walk or getting an ice cream on Mission Bay. And tonight we've just been at Chocolate Boutique in Parnell. There's a number of reasons why I enjoy living in the city, as opposed to living in the suburbs like I used to in Christchurch. Everything is less than 10 minutes walk away. The bar night, nightclubs, bars, restaurants, movie theatres and all the shops in Queen Street. That is definitely a huge pull to come to Auckland. Beyond that, all the big law firms and commercial firms are all got their main headquarters right in the middle of Auckland, providing me with heaps of opportunities as I get further on in my degree. I hope you've enjoyed watching a brief snapshot of my life, and I hope at the very least I've convinced you to give Auckland a try, because this Cantabrian definitely knows